I'm Pauline from Gitpod, and in today's screencast, we'll be talking about the Gitpod integration on GitLab. Using Gitpod and GitLab together is a seamless experience. You actually have two options to get started and open a cloud development environment using GitLab. Here, we're using a template TypeScript React project and directly from the repo, you can see that there's a button here that says Web IDE. And what you can do is just click this drop down menu and then click on Gitpod. And that, once you click this button, it automatically starts a new Gitpod workspace in the cloud. Alternatively, if you have our browser extension installed, all you would need to do is click this Gitpod button. So let's open up a Gitpod workspace. As you can see, this gives us an option to change our editor. We are going to open the Gitpod workspace in VS Code, but you can also use JetBrains IDEs such as IntelliJ, uh, Golang, PyCharm, etc. We can also change our workspace class. And as just as a reminder, the context that we're using is our GitLab context here. So now let's open a workspace. So what Gitpod does is it takes the Git context and sets up everything I need automatically. Once it opens, I've got a fully running application and complete dev environment that I need to work. And we've already got our dev server set up and this is all done using the magic of our Gitpod YAML configuration file. I'll link a video that talks through the Gitpod YAML file and how to configure it if you want to find out more. So let's just make an edit here together. And for this React app, we will just change the, um, the text here and we'll put something else like, hello. Before committing, I want to share the code with someone on my team. Gitpod lets me share my workspace with others using a simple link. I can send this to them and boom, that person has access to this exact same environment and is able to interact with all the same services and is visible simultaneously across both sessions. If you'd like to see this in action, I'll also link a YouTube video which shows this collaboration feature on Gitpod. And if we just head back over to GitLab and do a refresh, you can see that that commit went through and that we changed the text for um, this React app. And there you have it. You committed some code using your cloud development environments without having anything in your local machine. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you have any more questions, feel free to drop by our community Discord server at gitpod.io slash chat. See you there.